His friends watched him walk up the stairs. They couldn't quite see him go into the apartment. It's been nearly 26 years since Keith Mann was seen. The cold case is still open, which means public information is limited. We tried to get the reports, um, but they, it's still an open case, so we don't, we don't see everything that they have. But some of it was read to us that yeah. uh, what we were told by someone and, and, uh, in the beginning, and then all of a sudden it changed, you know, through the police report. Solve the Case is a nonprofit founded by Detective Aaron Benzik. Benzik went to high school with Keith, but didn't know him personally. Benzik has chosen Keith's case as his first to feature on the nonprofit's website. Of course, you know, everything he finds out, he's already getting in some mes uh, messages and tips have already came in. Um, he'll pass them along to, to the new cold case detective. Um. Deborah says with Detective Benzik on the case, there is a new hope. Maybe people just might be more open to saying what they know. Maybe for some reason they haven't been, you know, wanting to come forward to the, the Wichita Falls Police Department, so they've been keeping things back. But, um, you know, maybe they'll, they'll reveal something that, you know, will really help us. The mans say Benzik will take a deeper dive into the night of Keith's disappearance. Something happened to him. Somebody needs to talk is what they need to do. So um, I'm hoping that that will happen. I feel like we're going to find him one sometime or another.